Hello, my name is Quinn Kimmett. And I'm Vince Devine. And today, well, what are we doing today? I'm going to teach you how to set up a realistic green screen video using some light techniques and obviously a green screen. Sounds fun. Let's jump into it. All right, so the first part of the setup is obviously getting a green screen. So if you want to grab that, you can get started. Sure. And the green screen we're using today is a bulb green screen because it's pretty flat, it doesn't have any wrinkles, so it's a lot easier to edit later. There's no shadows from the wrinkles. Nice, now that we're done with that, we're gonna set up our lights. So the first two we're gonna turn on are these ones up here. These lights are meant to light up this green screen creating an even color, no hot spots. So, yep, and then we're gonna bring in a third light that will light up Quinn and make it so he's evenly lit in front of the green screen. Now that we got our lights set up, um, I'm going to have you pull up a stool and we'll get filming your video. Cool. We'll do a little test shot to make sure that it all looks good. And I like to have Quinn positioned three to five feet away from the screen just to make sure that he's not casting any shadows on the screen so that everything's even and there's no hot spots later when we're editing this. So it looks, looks pretty good. It looks nice and even. And even and lit, so it should be good. Okay, so for our realistic video, I'm gonna have Quinn um, sit in front of this fan so that it blows his hair around and makes it look like he's actually inside of a blizzard. Why? Why did I pick today to wear this t-shirt? So now that we're in Premiere Pro, I'm going to show you how to edit this video to make it look as realistic as possible. So this is what we got so far. Um, just Quinn in front of the green background. It looks good. So the first step is going to be going to the effects panel. And we're going to pull up the ultra key effect. I'm just going to drag and drop that. So now that that's there, we're going to select the key color as the green background. And we're gonna make sure all the settings are right so that it looks good. We're gonna turn the pedestal all the way up. All right, so now we got a nice even black background. Make sure the transparency is at a normal setting. And that's what we got so far. All right, now we're gonna drag our blizzard background underneath the video of Quinn. So that's what it looks like when he's just on top of that. And then now I'm gonna drag over some snow falling effects on top of him just to make it look more realistic. So that's what it looks like so far. Already looks pretty good. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag over some roaring wind sound effects just to add some more realism. We'll play that back. Looks good. All right, and we should be done, that looks good. Why did I pick today to wear this t-shirt? Well, Vince, that was interesting. Thank you for showing me that. Yeah, that went great. Did you learn a lot today? I did. Do you have anything you want to teach me how to do? Um, Any cool skills you have or something like that? Uh, geez, you're kind of putting me on the spot here. Yeah, I know. Uh, well, I can uh, lick a lollipop off in three licks. Really? Yeah. Let's see it. Got the first look. <laughs> it's a second lick. Whoa. Nice 
job. I know. That was I'm, impressive. I hope that you learned as much from me as I did from you. Yeah, next time you'll be teaching me some filming techniques. Hopefully, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll be doing that. Great. So, stay tuned for the next episode. <laughs>